very good evening to all our students and parents who have taken time out today to attend uh, an exclusive webinar with the university, which is Eastern Mediterranean and which is from Turkey, along with Ganberi. So I would like to thank all of them today who all are attending the webinar. Uh, we have with us Mr. Dr. Amjad Taha. He is, he, he's from the International Admissions Department. And today he will be taking us through the entire presentation and helping us with more information about Eastern Mediterranean University. And for those of you who don't know or who've already been attending our webinars, myself, Ms. Pranali Damankar, I am part of Ganberi, and I will be the host for today's evening. Since all of you are aware of how Ganberi helps the students, I would just like to take you through, which is our services, which is one-on-one -on -one personalized assistance and guidance throughout the admission process, which we give to our students. Uh, our assistance is free of charge and students only pay for application fee to the university if any required. We also have our service, which is a super mentor, which is nothing but one-on-one -on -one mentoring from senior students of the university. So when the students, the potential students or students who are today attending would want to know about more about the university, they can go on our website, which is Ganberi. And on our website, we have services, one of the services, which is Super Mentor. So you can connect with the students and get more information about the university. Today's agenda is obviously, it's a 60 minute webinar, out of which 30 minutes is only the presentation, which Dr. Amjad Taha will do, and followed by the Q&A, which is for 20 to 25 minutes. So students, uh, please do listen to Dr. Amjad. And uh, Dr. Amjad, over to you. And I will stop sharing my screen and you can share yours. Okay, thanks a lot. Now we are sharing the screen. Before we start, I would like to thank you for this opportunity for hosting us today uh, for doing this presentation. Uh, and we will be happy more to, to receive students from uh, different places around the world. Our university is Eastern Material University. Uh, we are located in Cyprus, uh, in the north side, nearby Turkey. Our university established on 1979. We have around 17,000 students from different places around the world from 110 countries, 1,000 qualified instructors from the 40 countries uh, around the world. They are teaching in different faculties and different programs. Our university have a big and large campus uh, stating on the, in the middle of the city called Famagusta. Uh, we are nearby to the sea. As you know that the island always it's around surrounded by the sea. Our university it is uh, it is in the heart of the city. Uh, the city name is Famagusta. We have around sixty thousand graduates from our university, as our university one of the oldest university in the island, as established on nineteen seventy nine. Uh, we are around forty two years uh, in in the education uh, sections. We are number one as a state university as a government university in northern Cyprus and number six in Turkey and our uh, recently evaluation from time higher education we are uh, beyond 501 uh, university uh, international universities around the world. Uh, these uh, accreditations and uh, memberships and set for our university it's existing. Uh, this uh, evaluation from the time higher education was last year uh, the updated one we received it like a couple of weeks ago. We become, as, a, as I said, that is a top 501 university around the world. In the last year, we were uh, we were around 801 owning the world university. But this year, thanks thanks for the efforts and the support that given from our uh, academic and administrative staff to work hard, okay, to increase our rank because we are seeking for high quality of education. 
Uh, also, we have a general, like we call it general accreditation for our university and also ranking status. Uh, QS, as you can see, this is one of the prestigious okay, ranking in the world for the international university. Our university is ranked five out of five in most of the field of the QS. Uh, also, as I said, that we have a general one and we have a specific one for each faculties. And this is very important for the student interested to study abroad after the completing their undergraduate or their master degree from our university or they want to complete it for phd degree they have they have to concentrate especially for the accreditation for each faculty our university having different uh, different accreditations especially for some faculty like engineering we have abit accreditation accreditation board of engineering and technology uh, it is very interested and high prestige and a few universities around the world they are holding this kind of uh, accreditation uh, also, we have the DICWOL, uh, the Teaching, Education, Quality, and Tourism also. Uh, also, we have a NAP from the uh, Architecture Department. Uh, also, we have uh, different and different uh, accreditation for each faculty. And this is, can help the student when they graduate to not face a problem uh, when they want to apply for Chamber of Engineering or they want to get exemptions for their certificate or they want to apply for master or apply for another another kind of a scholarship around the world is offered from the international institution. This is can be available by choosing EMU. Because of that, we are we are always uh, asking ourselves why students should choose EMU. The important thing is the quality of education is very high. The accreditation the students they are receiving while they study in our university, it's it makes them uh, able to compete in the international market also it can help the student okay to uh, be competent uh, in terms of uh, receiving kind of a scholarship uh, training internships and cetera it can be affordable okay by the students who are studying in our university also uh, our university not requesting IELTS or TOEFL as other universities around the world like in UK or US uh, it's not compulsory for us because our university is an international accredited university. We can do our internal exam for the student to evaluate their level of English. And in that sense, okay, the student, if they pass in that exam, they will join their faculty. And most of our program is teach for four years, not uh, five years. But if the student need a preparation for English, this is another advantage. Okay, then they will take this one year for preparation, then they will join their department. But if, if not, they are not uh, their their English, the level of English is allowed them to join the faculty straightforward they will go and they will be graduating for four years as you can see in the screen we have around 204 undergraduate associate programs three years programs two years program and four year program plus we have the postgraduate program master with thesis and without thesis plus the doctorate program phd program with thesis this is the advantage why we choose emu because there's no much restrictions by taking the acceptance for our university like the other universities around the world. Uh, one more thing, okay, student can interested, especially for the master student who are working, if they need to study online program, distance program, we have just only two, two, on, two programs only. One is banking and finance online with thesis and the other one in hotel management online without thesis. This is also uh, another advantage we are giving the students who are working or the, uh, I mean, the employee they work in, in these sectors, they can join our university and they can apply for these programs and they can join just only these online programs and getting the certificate while they are abroad. This is also our advantage by studying in EMU. Also, why we choose EMU? We choose EMU because EMU offering also scholarship for our international students. We are offering 50% scholarship for all the international students joining our university for this year. Uh, and also, we are offering additional discount for some countries, okay, that we call them under special situation from the Middle East country, like Libya, Sudan, Yemen, Iraq, and Afghanistan, and also Syria. In those six countries, we are giving them also this year additional discount, and especially for this semester, spring semester intake started, and the student can apply through our representative, and from there, they can receive this kind of 10% additional discount for their nationality because this nationality we are counting them as a special cases for the international student from different places around the world also we are giving them another advantage to choose emu 25 percent additional discount for the successful student in under the graduate degree if the student they are successful in their high school grades okay they can join our university and they receive additional discount 25 percent if they apply through our representative around the world 
This is uh, also another advantage to choose EM. And also, if the student they are interested to join university and they want to get early bird discount after they complete their tuition fees for the first semester, the student can receive 5% additional discount. Also, for our successful student in high school, uh, the high school uh, grades as undergraduate or as a postgraduate uh, who completing their undergraduate abroad and they want to join our university for undergraduate degree or postgraduate degree, also there's a chance for them to receive 100% scholarship for the tuition fees if they apply now. This is also advantage, okay, for choosing EMU. If you join another university, you will not have this opportunity of the tuition fees that we are offering uh, for uh, our students for this year, as we are considering the situation of this year, it is a very restricted because of COVID-19 issues and the pandemic we are considering to handle these kind of issues for our students who want to join for this semester. Also, the other advantage for choosing EMU, we have exchange programs who do want to study abroad. As you know that most of them they are applying to UK and they're not getting the visa. There's a lot of restriction or US or Australia or other countries. But by our university, if you choose EMU, you come and study for two semesters here. I mean, two years completely in Eastern Material University in Northern Cyprus. And then from there, you can apply for the exchange program unit. And if you are a successful student, EMU can help you to be joining uh, this university by funding from the university social fund. We are helping our students to be joining university abroad for one semester or two semesters. It depends on their grades. Our university is not a profitable university as we are considering the quality of education. This is the advantage of EMU because we are a state university. We are getting support and uh, donations from the government to increase the level of education as much as we can. This is the important by choosing EMU. If the student is interested to go UK, they can join EMU, study for two years, and then they can go, go to UK by getting their chance from EMU. If they want to go to Canada, or they can possible to go there. If you want to go to US, also it's possible. And other countries in Europe, also the same. Also in the Middle East country, they can join for one semester and two semesters. We are sending some of the students. And also for the summer courses, the student can be staying with their family and study in their uh, local university in their back country. This is advantage of studying in EM. We are not doing restriction for the people who are willing to study in our EM. Around the collaboration, our university collaborations, around 180 universities around the world. We have a special contract with them for education term, academic side, and exchange program. Also, in our university, for the student who is interested to study Warwick University program, also is operating in Eastern Material University, and we are offering for the student who is interested for master degree in different fields, we are offering for them a 20% and 40% discount. It depends on their score. And the scholarship committee will evaluate the student who is applying for Warwick program. Warwick program is a very interesting program. It's helping the student, okay, to get the certificate from Warwick University, uh, top, top 10 university in UK and 100 in the world. Uh, you don't need to pay this much money as you are traveling to UK. You can study in EMU with the cheapest price, okay, for this program. The total cost of this program is $19,000. Uh, and also students can receive a scholarship, as I said, 20%, 40%, it depends on their grade. We are trying to select the successful student for this program, and this is specific for master's student. Our university graduate from undergraduate program who are joining this program also, we are giving them automatically a 20% discount. This is also another advantage why we choose it. Another thing is important, okay, we have very, very interested program with the Bologna University. We call this program International Collaboration Program with the Bologna University. It's a legal comparative law. It is English, pro, English medium of instruction. And this is very interested program around the world. And many of the, and, and many of the lawyers that are interested to complete their master's degree uh, in English medium of instruction program, we can offer this program at 10 courses without thesis, and the student can be, uh, who joining this program, they will be eligible to be working for international company around the world. For the dormitories, you don't need to be worried regarding to that because EMU is uh, affording the student, okay, in different stages of dormitories. We are having dormitories, okay, it can fit in the low, uh, I, mean, I mean, the conservative income students and also medium and high level of the student. And we have all the, we have all the sample or, or we have all the group sample distribution of the students coming from different places around the world. Because of that, our structure in EMU, we having the fit 
uh, the fit for all the students, okay, for their needed to study in our university. The dormitory prices is different from dorms to other dorms. It depends on the student what, what they want to choose. This is also important for the student and we have like different level or different layers of income can help the student, okay, to be survival in our university. Plus we are offering the work for the student to gain experience after the first semester of their study in our university. They can work legally in our university and they can gain experience and plus pocket money. It's, it's also, uh, it should be fitted with their schedule of studying in our university because as I said in the beginning, we are caring about the quality and plus a, that a graduate student, they have also experience and charisma okay, for competing in the international market. Uh, activities, we have different kinds of activity inside of our campus. As I said that we have a campus, it's, 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 it's a very big campus and the student can be enjoying with different clubs, uh, different activity tours we are doing. We are arranging different kinds of activity inside of the campus, like international night, spring semester, uh, spring festivals, uh, and also the night of the countries. We have around uh, 110 nationalities in our campus. And we have a society representing those students from different countries around the world. We have like from Middle East and North Africa, we have from Africa, from CS countries, and where from Europe countries, they are joining our university. Those ones, they have their representative and we are doing legal elections for them to choose their representative. And from there, we can learn the international interactions for the cultural diversifications in our campus. Uh, the safety is very high. Uh, we have like uh, like 60 to 60 uh, percent to 40 percent uh, between the male and female in our campus. It's a very good percentage. We are trying to increase the number of our nationalities and gender in our campus between the two sides to reach it 50-50. Uh, we are doing this is our target until 2024. Uh, and also we are inter interested to increase the nationality that are joining our campus to reach 100 uh, 85 nationality by the end of 2025. Uh, this is our interested side. As I said, that we are not interested for profit, as we are interested for the high quality of education and gathering more international students as we are state university. Uh, the fees of the dorm, okay, as I said, that okay, we have different uh, layers regarding to that. We are having like a system for the payment for all the students can feel feel the, they are relaxing. They can be installment or they can be in cash. Okay, the installment it can be for four four installment in one semester. Uh, for the year, it will be eight installments. Okay, given to the students a chance to complete their payments and their parents, they can be affording the price of paying the dorms and the tuition fees of university. Uh, this is also a uh, advantage of ENU and also for the tuition fees. Uh, a part of the fir the first semester student can also pay the first installment and get their student certificate and then they can install the rest of the payment for the three payment more for one semester i mean for the spring semester uh, and this is also another uh, policy we created uh, within the pandemic period before we were asking the full tuition fees for one semester and then the student can be registered in our university but now because of the covid 19 issue we are asking the first installment and all these details can be uh, showing in uh, the acceptance letter when we are showing to the student, you will see all the things it's uh, it's mentioned for the tuition fees for each program because our prices with the 50% the scholarship it's between 2,500 to uh, to 4,000 uh, 4,000 dollar. Uh, it depends on the program, but this is the average between the programs for engineering. For example, it's between 2,770 dollar. Uh, after the discount for one semester for the for example for the uh, for the business administrations uh, we are uh, we are uh, we are charging two thousand three hundred dollars in a semester for for example for a physics department it will be two thousand four hundred dollar uh, for the pharmacy department we are charging four thousand two hundred dollar uh, and cetera but the average between as I said that between two thousand five hundred to uh, to four thousand five hundred dollar uh, in a semester for the student, and the student can be able to pay. Uh, I mean, the installment pays, or if they are successful student, they will receive additional discount. As I mentioned before, or hundred percent scholar ship. Our admission is for a fee. We are not charging the student to pay any money. You can apply from uh, from uh, from your representative that hosting us for. This meeting today, it can helping you and assisting you for all the services and give you that okay, the chance 
to get the admission letter and you will see all the details regarding to that. Uh, our admission criteria, we are accepting the student from 65% and above in their high school uh, degree. For master, uh, we are accepting for without thesis 2.2, for, uh, for the thesis program, we are accepting 2.5 uh, out of four. Uh, for, the, for the PhD program, we are accepting the student 2.79 out of four. Uh, then the student will be eligible to join our program. And this is in general, specifically each program, I mean, in our university, it goes for the committee of evaluation from the department before we are issuing the acceptance letter. Then when you get the acceptance letter from our university, you have, to, you have, one, you have two options. Either you pay the full tuition fee for one semester and get 5% additional discount before early bird discount, or you pay the first installment and then you will get uh, also registration for our university. And this is like a new policy from our university to help the student and parents, okay, to cover the cost of an installment pay. <clears throat> uh, also, the student they not receiving this 100% scholarship, they have a chance if they are confirming their registration our university by being the first in installment, they can go for the second round of evaluation for the scholarship because you know that the first round, okay, can student can be uh, not coming and then we have to replace them with someone else by you are paying for the first uh, first installment or the first or the first semester tuition fee in cash fully. Uh, in that sense, your name can be nominated again for the evaluation for 100% scholarship. And as I said that our criteria is the grade. The grade is very important and your nationality because we are issuing for each two national, I mean, for each nationality to seek 100% scholarship. This is for nationality, we call it for 100% scholarship for tuition fees. And also we are offering 100% scholarship for the students who are successful also from different countries around the world. Then, okay, if I didn't receive in my acceptance letter 100% scholarship, I have a chance to receive it in, in the second round of evaluation. Usually we are doing this evaluation before the beginning of the semester, 10 days from the class commerce. We are doing the second round of evaluation for the applicant student who applied and paid their tuition fees. And if we see that those people that are successful students, we are offering for them the 100% scholarship. This is in general uh, about the requirement. We spoke about it, the tuition fees. Uh, also, uh, it is mentioned in our brochures and uh, plenary can help you or for, for receiving all this information and details from their website and from their platforms. Uh, as I said, that the payment system, it can be going in two ways. One way it can go for online and the second way it can go through the bank transfer. We are accepting both sides, and but, but we are preferring the online payment. It's more faster and more easier and more cheaper for the student if they are uh, willing to join our university. Please share with your representative, your payment receipt to follow with us. Uh, I mean, the other issues regarding to registration, to arrive to Cyprus for orientation program. We are welcoming the student, we're welcoming their families. For, we're not asking for money when we are big, you are from the airport. We are giving this uh, free service for our university, okay? Uh, I mean, uh, policy to help our new student with their family if they want to join our university as a beginning. You know that most of the parents, they are interested to come with their uh, kids to make sure that they are settled and everything is going well. All these services offered by EMU for free for the student to arrive to service. Uh, then the first step after we get the scholarship, uh, I mean, after we get the acceptance letter, we complete the payment. If we not receive the 100% scholarship, okay, we can pay the first installment or pay the full tuition fees for one semester uh, to earn also 5% and wait the next evaluations for 100% scholarship. If you receive it in the second round of evaluation, you will receive okay an email, official email from our university, and the money you paid, okay, it will be refunded or it will be deducted for your activity fund because we are charging $200 just only for your health service or health insurance that covered by university. It can be this amount of money can be deducted for, I mean, uh, for the health insurance. That's all from Eastern. <clears throat> This is in general about our university. I will leave the floor for you if you have any kind of questions uh, to listen from you. Uh, just I need to add one more thing uh, before we leave. The visa, it's very easy for us. If you complete your process, we will be assisting you regarding to the visa issue through our representative. We will do all the process. It can support you to get the visa if your passport requires the visa to travel to Northern Cyprus. But most of the country, like let's say that around, okay, 70% of the country is not required a visa to arrive to Northern Cyprus. 
but we can handle this kind of issue if your passport need a visa uh, from our representative or from Turkish embassy in the country that you are staying. Thank you lots for your uh, kindly uh, uh, kind listening to us, and I leave the floor for you, Mr. Miss Panalar. Thank you, Dr. Amjad, uh, for the wonderful presentation and explaining about the requirements, scholarships, and about the university to our existing students who are today with us for the webinar. I think that ends, brings us to the end of the webinar as well. Dr. Amjad, thank you so much for your time. And uh, I think it's been quite uh, helpful to our students. Definitely, uh, you know, if, we, if there are any further questions which I want to know, I will definitely connect with you and uh, get it more from you. Anytime. Thanks a lot for your hosting for us today. It's thank our you, pleasure thank to you give so the much. presentation for your students. And we wish now more number of students coming to apply for spring semester for other faculty rather than medicine and industry. From other faculty, the admission is open, as I said. And we are interested to have more international students to join our faculty from different places around the world. I wish the best for Great. all of us for this semester and next semester by, uh, by your support and by your efforts. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Amjad. Thank you for your time and take care. And thank you, students, for attending the webinar. Have a great evening and take care of yourself. Thanks thank a lot. you. Bye-bye. Thank you, Dr. Amjad. See you.